All right, my friends, this is going to be the first video of my new um, um, landscaping rocks. I've got uh, a lot of church and stuff. Pretty cool looking one right there. I don't know why, just weird looking. This one ought to come out with pretty nice pilots, I think. Oh, it's got a cool pattern. Hope it stays like that. If it does, it'll be cool. This is the one I really like. This thing here is crazy. I don't even know if it's church or not, but it's cool looking, whatever it is. Yeah, definitely have to get that one polished. This one, just different. I like that looking. Nothing great about it, but that polish is up real nice. Another one. It's got a few lines, and it might come out a few more lines whenever we're polishing. Hmm. I don't know. And we got a piece of jasper with some quartz running to another piece I found like um, in the other landscape in Roxo. It could be come from the same area. We got a really cool piece of... I don't know what that is. I guess it's quartz with some red in it somehow. I don't know. I don't know if that's moss or what, but man, that is cool. That's going to be a beauty when it's polished. That is cool. And we got a few more pieces up here. This thing is, I don't think that's true, but I don't know what it is. Could be. Alright, now we have a few fossils. This thing here is... I don't know if that's sponge or just smashed up coral. I don't know. It's, some, it's either one or one of them two, I think. But it's cool. It's a big chunk. I think it's smashed up coral. Whatever that would be called. It's also got a little agate in it right there. Hmm. Maybe we might cut that one. Huh? You don't want to cut that for stud of duck? the thought and this one I think is some kind of fossil sometimes y'all say hey you idiot that's not a fossil but I don't know looks like one of me so we'll see this one's definitely a little piece of coral I like it alright this last piece of coral is a beauty I know, I'm not sure exactly what piece it is what kind it is but it's a beauty, whatever it is. Yeah. That is nice. Yep, yeah, I like that. Okay, here we got some geo pieces, some unknown pieces. This is definitely a little geo, I guess. Could have been a brain quartz or something that broke open. That's pretty cool. This is just, well, no, it's got to be, I don't know what that is. But it's going to look pretty cool polished, I think. And this one, that's a brain quartz that was, that was broken open. Got some eyes on it. Pretty cool. This is definitely a weird little piece of chalcedony, I think. It's just, that's all it is, I think. I don't know. I've never found anything like that. That's a big jelly bean, I guess. I don't know. Okay, this is the one I really think is one of the crazy ones in the, uh, out there. I have no idea what this is. If y'all can see, I don't know if it's going to show up there on camera like it is, but I don't have no idea what the heck this is. And it is cool, though. I mean, it's got pattern, moss, um, everything on it that you would want. This has an odd shape to it. I kind of got a feeling it's going to show up on stud and dud, but it really doesn't have a cutting shape. I might just try and polish it whole, but this thing is crazy. I mean, it's got red, white, yellow, gold, orange, uh, all kind of mossy looking stuff, little agate lines. Um, I don't know. I have no idea what this is, but that's got to be one of the craziest ones I found out there. I think this one's definitely a piece of a geode. Um, but the color on it is crazy. It's a pinkish color. That is nice. I like that. Another crazy geo. This one here, I soaked it in iron out for a couple of hours and nothing there. 
a little bit of it came off. It had a little rust stains in there, but the rest of it stayed yellow like that. I mean, and it's, dru it's real druzy and um, shiny, kind of shiny, but it's real druzy. Okay, this one I think is a Missouri lace egg, I think. It's not a Crowley. It's got a lot of druzy, a lot of Botrardos. That's cool. Another piece of a geode. Nice rock. I think this is a piece of petrified wood. Looks like it. Not positive. I've been faked out before. This one here is an odd little crystal sandwich. It looks like it's all crystals in there. I should have never got it wet, but that's all crystals inside that middle part. I have no idea. Never seen anything like that before out there. And this one here, I'm sure there's going to be some non-believers, but I swear I picked this up in the gravel, in the, in the landscaping rocks. It's smooth, but it's not. I don't know if it's smooth enough to have come all the way from Missouri. But I guarantee, I didn't think nothing of it when I saw it. I just picked it up, and then when I was looking at the bucket a little while ago, I'm like, how in the world did that get in there? But I remember picking it up out there. I just don't remember. I don't know how it got down here. That is... Um, that was definitely a pickup off the river. I mean, off the uh, landscaping rocks. So, I don't know. But it was definitely there. <laughs> I swear on everything I got, I wasn't, it wasn't planted. No reason to plant it. I'm not, a, I'm not a crystal person anyway, so. All right, all that other stuff was cool and everything, but let's quit kidding ourselves. This is what we're here to see. We got some Crowleys, and this bucket is loaded with them. This one's a little broken and cracked up, but it's still pretty cool. This one, really light pattern all over, but it's definitely a crawling. And the front is pretty cool. I like that. This is a big boy here. I like this one. That thing is totally filled with pattern. One of the few I think that's not broken or chipped. Most of them at least have a chip out of it. That is cool right there. And that is the back side of the school anyway, but yeah, that's a good one. I like that one. All right, another one broken, but cool. Like it. This one has a little bit of that yellowish orange color to it. Yeah, that is cool. I don't think it's broken either. Got a nice little pocket in there. Yeah, that's a cool one. This one, the back side looks kind of plain, but the sides all like that's all the way around. Totally fortified. And the top is pretty cool too. I like that. Alright, this one here, the back side, not too cool. It's got a pattern everywhere on it though. But the front is pretty cool. That is a nice little flower look. I don't know, it looks like a flower to me. That is cool. This one back is not great. Yeah, that's a crawler. I thought it might not have been a crawler, but I'm pretty sure it is. Just a weird pattern to it. Listen, here's another one. If it don't have that chip out of it, it's a beauty, man. It still is, but it's got a little chip off the end. But this thing is really cool. This is a little monster here. This thing is all pattern. Nothing but pattern on it. Banded and fortified all the way around. That's a beauty. Alright, this is a really cool one. Really, really cool. Got banding fortified all the way around. Funny looking pattern right there. Yeah, that's a cool one. And this one here is an absolute monster. This thing looks more like Crazy Lace than it does a Crowley. But it's definitely 100% a Crowley. Look at the banding on this thing. And right there, man, one chip out of it. Man, this thing is gorgeous. I don't care about the chip. I've never seen a pattern like that before on a Crowley. Look at that thing. That is nuts.
Whoops. Alright, this one's an absolute beauty too. Got pattern everywhere, all the way around. Really cool rock. That pattern is crazy. Alright, this one here, pretty sure it's a Crowley. Wouldn't wouldn't sweat to it, but yeah. It's got enough lines on, I think, on this side to make it a Crowley. The other side's kind of questionable, but this one here, I think, is definitely a Crowley. That's a cool rock, though. <laughs> Whatever it is, that's a cool rock. This one here is absolutely crazy. I don't know how it survived without breaking this little bit thin thing, but look at the pattern on this thing. That is, that's the bad side. Look at that side. That crazy or what? Alright, this one here's got some crazy pattern and color to it. Got a big quartz face in it with one chip out of it, of course. But look at the pattern on this thing. That is crazy, my friends. Loaded with pattern. This one's just a piece, but we got... It really would have been a nice rock if it had been whole. This one's broken. I like this pattern, but... Real, real light. Almost a white one, but... The bottom of it's missing. And this is the one. It's nothing but Matrix, mostly. But it's got one Botrardo. Not Botrardos. Botrardo. But the back is definitely crawling. That's a pretty cool rock. Alright, this is a yellow and white one. Two odd colors on this thing, but this thing has got pattern everywhere. Got a chip missing. Whoa. Fumble fingers here. But yeah, this thing's got crazy pattern on it. That's all I'm gonna say. I like this rock. The white makes it really look cool and different. This one here, had it been whole, it probably could have been the top 20 all time of all my crawlers, all the probably 2,000 crawlers I found. But, I mean, it's red, it's got pattern all over the back of it. The front's got a crazy, would have a crazy looking pattern with a white, a white border, a white line on it. But just knocked the end of it off, it's gone. But this could have been a really, a really, really good rock. But it still is. I'll take it. That little pattern there is really cool. Yeah. I will definitely take it. 